Hey guys, uh, I just wanted to get a little moan off my chest whereby logos, design agencies. So I just wanted the SG50 uh, logo to use in a video of mine and I downloaded it and it's pretty typical to be honest. So what's in the zip file? You get the, the sort of standard guidelines in a PDF. Okay, PDF, I can read that kind of, kind of, but, but the, the worst thing is is that um, well these all these the junk of uh, you know the thumbs dot db uh, I guess that's from Windows and the DS store um, that's from Mac OS X. Um, the original files are on Adobe Illustrator format which is good I guess because that's the the vector graphic but unfortunately. Adobe Illustrator is proprietary, and that's a proprietary standard, uh, not, uh, not a standard, it's proprietary. Uh, someone who doesn't have a license to Adobe Illustrator cannot open that file. What would be a better vector graphic format is SVG. Okay, so it's missing an SVG uh, file in that sort of um, logo package. And furthermore, um, it includes JPEGs. JPEG for a logo is the wrong format because it's a it's a lossy format. So that m means that the the edges will not be crisp like they would be in a better format like PNG or PNG as it can, can be also called. Uh, just to demonstrate that the edges are not um, clean is like if you really zoom in there you see how that's you see how it's all blurry that's a, an artifact of JPEG if this design agency uses use PNG it would be crisp unfortunately they didn't so great sadness please please the takeaway is use SVG and open standards anything can al almost read SVG it's web compatible Please, please, if you don't use SVG, use ping, SVG ping. Use them both, ideally.